Good morning. This is Coach Pete giving you guys an update as far as uh, what's going on over here at the Kiahuna Plantation, as you can see in the background. Uh, it's about 6.30 in the morning over here in Hawaii. And uh, yesterday we had two ball games, one against Team Easton. We won that game 11-3. Second game, we played a young team, 11U team, and they... Uh, we're a local team and believe it or not, they gave us a hard time. We pulled it off at 9-2, to two, but one thing that I suspect is going to happen all the way through is um, there's going to be some home cooking, if you know what I mean. But uh, we were able to to still pull it off 9-2 with all the bad calls that went against us. And, you know, the weather's getting better better looks like on the west side of the island it doesn't rain as much according to the locals they say over there it doesn't rain as much it did sprinkle yesterday but the whole west side of the island is made up of red clay the kind of clay or not not like red dirt the kind of dirt that baseball fields uh pay for big money you know so that when it rains it soaks it up absorbs it and then it's no longer um wet many of the fields in LA that we play at it rains a little bit and it's done for the whole weekend but over here I mean it was raining and the fields were flawless it has to do something with that dirt it absorbs it absorbs the, the rain really good um, but anyways today we play at one o'clock Amy Beltran is actually um, live streaming it uh, out of her account we were unable to connect it with my account but if you guys wanted to watch the games live we'll be playing today at four o'clock against a, another Hawaii team um, travel team I think from Maui not exactly sure where they're from but um, we'll be playing at about four o'clock and like I said Amy she's uh, one, one of the one of the family members who's following us on Facebook, I think you can look her up and then request her as a friend so you can follow the the live stream games. Otherwise, the other option is uh, when the game's over, I'll copy it and I'll paste it on our page so everybody can watch it. <coughs> no longer will it be live. But yeah, yesterday I had my ruins because I hadn't unpacked yet and my baseball gear was still packed away. And I haven't really had a chance to do anything over here in, in Kauai. Um, other than go to the beach, uh, simply because my mind is wrapped up in this game. Um, don't want to forget anything. Uh, I didn't want to go anywhere because I was like, okay, I got to make sure I don't forget the catcher's glove, the mask, some gear, I don't know, uh, gloves. Whatever, whatever it is I had, I just didn't want to make that mistake. I'm sure it's happened to some coaches where you go, big tournament, and you forget something or something gets left behind. I had to make sure everything gets gets done, taken care of. But uh, anyways, I heard that it was about 108 degrees, 110 degrees back home. I'm like, I'm glad I missed that because I don't, I don't have air conditioning at my home. So that's really hot. I think that's a record. I, I never heard of it being about 108 degrees in the area of El Sereno. That's really hot. The hottest I ever heard is about 103 degrees. But anyways, over here, there's, you saw people, I don't know if you saw people running in the background. They're running in shorts and freaking little uh, shirts. 5 o'clock in the morning, raining, people still running shirtless and stuff out here. Nice, nice, nice weather. But um, anyways... I'll check back in later on and uh, try to give you guys an update when when I get a chance, if I remember, to record. Alright, I'm out.